Good morning, good morning, good morning, everyone. How we doing? How we doing? How we doing? I'm not wearing any glasses because I'm a div and I've forgotten, but I don't care. How we doing, everyone? Welcome, welcome, welcome. You should know the drill by now. Save it, TV. It's me. It's Spoonie. How we doing? Morning, Ali. Oh, 10 gift. Oh, you're a 10 gift subber. Hello, Ali. How you doing? Oh, I've just seen your thing come up on my thingy. How we doing? How we doing? How we doing? Uh... Yeah, I wasn't quite sure what I was going to do today, so I'm literally... Well, I might as well just jump straight into it, because I'm not mucking about. Um, yeah, we're going to do some Danny Ground. Danny's come home. Um, the reason being... Boy, I've got literally nothing set up. Uh, give me a sec. Camera. Okay. Uh, so, yeah. I'm not too bad, Ali. Thank you. And I'm pretty sure you didn't do that on my stream. But, yeah, thank you for the 10 gifted subs whenever you did that. I just see I see your little icon on the thingy. Morning, Adam. How we doing, mate? Uh, yeah, so we're on at Stanley. Uh, I've got quite a bit to do today. And I've got a few little bits and bobs. But I thought, why not do both? Let's do a little stream while doing thingy. We need to get some 80s up. Uh, generate that, please. What time is it? It's 9 o'clock. It's going to be... Like that. So it's probably going to be a bit of a chill one. Hopefully, we'll get some traffic in. I'm presuming my overlays are working. I can't really see my uh, thingy. Uh, yep, my overlays are working. Beautiful. Great time for ads to start. Thank you, Bezos. Yeah, not too bad, mate. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to do some standing ground. I'm at London Stansted. Um, I can quickly show you the EFB. Uh, there's weather. It's it's all right. It's 2-2. Two -two. I need to actually set that up. That would be a good start, wouldn't it? I'm so bad. My lord. Uh, oh, no, wrong button. Whoops. Ow, I'm on one today. Uh, where are we? Where are we? Where are we? We're at Stanny. Stanny. So I want that selected and I want 2 2 selected because I've got Luton still selected. Whoopsie. Uh, where is Luton? You go away. Don't need no Luton. We want Hanstead. That's better. Right, let's get some V strips up. You guys can see some strips. Because who doesn't like a good stripper? Uh, that's him. Hey, anyway, Ali, mate. Much appreciated. I'm glad you enjoy him. Right, that's that done. Move that over. Here. That. Oh, over. Get you here for a minute. You, uh, there. Will be working See at the minute. You go over to there. I love I love my stream deck. I can just click on a window and go, right, you, I want to put you on this screen. Button. Bang. Done. Thank you. Love it. Love it. Love it. But no, appreciate the support, Ali. Like I said, all the money goes back into the channel. So it's much appreciated. We have got one guy on the ground. Uh about tower view at the moment just give me two seconds because uh, i need to reconfigure everything because i'm still set up with Luton. Any? Uh, done i go back to this uh Um, now I can switch it. If I hit that. Yeah, there we go. That's a bit better. I need to set up my more. Got it working with the Phoenix 320 now. I want to set up for non-flight sim as well. Yeah, I've I've gone a bit mad uh, with my stream deck. So I've got it set up. So I've just got like a normal screen where I've just got various controls. Um, and audio settings and this, that, the other. And then I've got a 
screen just for when I'm doing streaming so I can just hit a button and bang, there's all my streaming controls. Oh, thank you, Ali. You can stick around, Ali. You're a good egg. I apologize because I know I do the ultimate probably stream and no-no because you guys are here, but I look here because my chat's here. So I'm, if I'm always looking over here, it's because as you can see from the screen, I've got all my information up on there. Emails up and everything. Probably not a good idea to have emails up, but you know, what the hell. Discord. Ah, Discord. You can go there like that. There we go. Now I've got, I can still see what's going on in the Discord. Uh, so yeah, we got one aircraft. Uh, he's on the ground. He's at five one, right here. He's going to Barcelona. Apparently, there's a problem with his route, so we might actually have to check it. Let's have a look. Uh, it's a Cowley. It's going to be a. It's a Goodwood one. That's fancy pants. What's fancy pants? What? Was telling me, oh, okay. I was like, "What?" Right, it's Dam sending me messages. Uh, right, it's Cowley. For some reason, I don't quite know why. It's really annoying. It a lot of flight plans out of the UK use the um. There's a VOR called Goodwood, but when Simbrief issues the flight plans, it never gives them good. Well, never gives them Goodwood in the flight plan. Which then uh, our SRD checker that we control as use flags it as a problem. That's still wrong. What's going on with the flight plan? Uh, November. November 859. Good. And up in November 859. There we go. Fixed it. Yeah, it's really annoying. So yeah, this is probably just going to be a chill little sesh. Oh. oh dear. I think I might be in trouble on the Discord. I think I might be getting in trouble. <laughs> oh dear. Oh no, I think I might be in trouble. Good morning, uh, Rhino 54 Lima Zulu with Victor 7378 London on stand 5 on this. That request clearance to Barcelona. Uh, that's fine. Rhino 54 Lima Zulu stands the ground. Good morning. Clear to Barcelona. Nugbo 1 Romeo departure. Squawk 6253. Clear to Barcelona. Nugbo 1 Romeo. Squawk uh, 6253. Rhino 54 Lima Zulu and uh, we're ready for push. Ryan F54 Lima Zulu, Roger that. Uh, read back is correct. Information Victor current. QH is 1026. Stand 51 left. Push and start is approved. 1026 and uh, push and start approved. Ryan F54 Lima Zulu, thanks. There you go, he's pushing back. Yeah, he was ready to go. Yeah, he's on his way to uh, Barcelona. So yeah, it's, it's a, it's a, it's an issue. I don't know why. It's sim basically the issue is Simbrief. I don't know why. It's because Simbrief puts them on. Hang on, I need to show you guys a little nav map because it'll be. I need, I need to show you a visual aid. He's, we need to show you some visual aids. Doesn't love a good visual. Aid. Little nav maps. I've actually been on little map map in ages. Uh, go to there. Uh, show you. Yeah. Oh, it's the new version out. Okay. 
download that. Uh, love a bit and little nav map happen. Whoops, there's all my YouTube channel. Um, so you can you can see see yourself guys on Twitch chat. Yeah. Um, all this for now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know, I know, I know. Go away. Right. So reason is if I'm gonna if I nab this guy's flight plan, you guys. So you see, obviously, I know I fixed it, but so uh, you'll get my point. So you. Oh, yes. Okay. Go away. DSS, paste that, and he's going to Barcelona. Right, create flight plan. There we go. Right. Now, problem is, for some reason, this is, I, I'm pretty sure the, actually, I'll move the Twitch chat out of the way. There you go. Right. Can you report it directly as a bug? Um, I probably can. Um, it's not necessarily a bug. It's just an annoyance. It's... So basically, so this is this guy's flight plan. He's now pushed back, right? So this is his flight plan. Look, you see him going all the way down to Barcelona, right? Not a problem. The problem he has is, uh, I need to pull up the Juliet tank, is, as you can see, he does the, actually, let me just put a little bit more information in it. So show the departure procedures, put in the Nugbo 1, Romeo, where is it? There it is. Set the Nugbo 1. Right, so. This is what he's going to do. He's going to take off, and then he's going to do the Nugbo departure, which, as you can see, it's a bit weird for Stanny, but he's doing it to avoid London. So he comes here, turns right, turns left to Nugbo, right? Then he's on an airway. He's on Mike 183, which brings him down to Silver, which is here. Then he's on... A, is, it, is it Quebec? Uh, I never showed you the jetway. It's really annoying. What, look, all this information, it doesn't actually... Just show me that. I don't care about the region. Why does it show me the region, but not anything? Oh, whatever. So Mike 183. Then he's on Quebec 4-1. So after Silver, he then goes on Quebec 4-1 down to Cowley. Again, perfectly fine. Then he's Tango 7-1 all the way down to Vapid. Now, this is where it gets spicy. Because it's this jetway. Um, I can't, can't have it. Can you see this one here? It's up in November 859. So when you get onto Vapid, you you join up in November 859. However, Simbrief says, oh, so when you get to Vapid, you're on up in November 859 all the way down to Sopil, which is all the way down here. You're practically halfway into France, right? And uh, Rhino 54 Lima Zulu, cross taxi. Sort this guy up. Ryan F54 Lima Zulu taxi holding point Sierra One runway two two via Charlie Hotel and Sierra. Charlie Hotel Sierra to uh, Sierra One Ryan F54 Lima Zulu. Sierra One on the strip and then literally what I'm gonna say is there's London South on and no one else. And Ryan F54 Lima Zulu at Sierra One no further ATC available. It'll be free call over to Unicom one two two decimal eight. Have a safe flight. Bye bye. And that's the whole point over to Unicorn, right? If I fall in, see thanks, goodbye. So, yeah, I'm not mucking about. Uh, so, who's that? So, yeah, so it wants him on upper November 859 all the way down to mid France, right? The problem with this is, as per, I don't know why, he needs to be on November 859 to Goodwood. I don't know why Goodwood's down here. Look, can you see Goodwood? Here. Goodwood's here. Goodwood VOR's right here. Which is really annoying. Because November 859 is the same. It's, it's literally the same jetway. It's just, it's because of his altitude. I don't know why. So what it wants is him on November 859 to Goodwood. Then he can go on to upper November 859. I think... It's because if you actually look here, November 859 and upper November 859 actually peel off and go different ways. Am I losing my mind? Yeah, they go different ways. I do, don't ask me why. I don't know. But basically, it just throws a fit. And it's like, no, you ha he has to... So between Vapid and Goodwood, he has to be on November 859. And then from Goodwood the rest of the way, he's on upper November 859. 
I think it's because of this weird split where November 859 goes off to Drake, but up in November 859 actually finishes at um, Sitet. I don't know why. I, 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 I haven't got a clue, but that's why it does it. And it's really annoying. So there you go. There's a little bit of a controller lesson for you. Yeah, uh, five four Lima Zulu just gone on to the runway now, so he's gone over to Unicom, so I can get rid of his strip. Um, he did exactly what I wanted. Boom, gone, got rid of him. Another happy customer. Um, so yeah, it's just a weird. I don't know why. So whenever I see a flight plan and it flags it and says, "Oh no, the flight plan's wrong," it's usually no. It's just probably because he's going by November eight five nine and it wants me to stick Goodwood in. Really annoying. Because then it won't say the flight plan is okay unless I do it. Yeah, it just, it, I don't know why. It just, it goes just, just this weird little way. But according to the official SRD, which is the, the official like UK airspace route thingy, you have to be on November 859 to Goodwood. And then you go up in November 859. So if you don't have Goodwood, the, v, the VOR for Goodwood, which is actually an airport. It's Goodwood Airport here. It's also a race course, isn't it? Is there a good is there a race course at Goodwood if I remember rightly? Why not where um, Top Gear was filmed? I wanna say it is. Or was that somewhere else? I might be wrong. Can't remember. No, I might be wrong. Um but yeah. So is that realistic? Yeah. Goodwood is a hill climb. It's good with the race course. Yeah. So it's just a weird thing. So basically, Simbrief just says, oh, you go Vapid up in November 859 all the way into France. And it's like, no. And then my SRD always flags it and goes, no, you've got to go November 859 to Goodwood, then up in November 859 the rest of the way. It's it's so annoying. It's aggravating as hell. Because like, you can see it coming. Uh, oh, no, you can't see my screen. Uh, it's the... See the little SRD checker flagging it here, saying here's the valid routings. And this one says Goodwood. Uh, that one just says you go to Sitet by Lima 151. And then this one is November 859 to Goodwood, up in November 859 to Sitet. Really annoying. Uh, I, I think they have a small track to Ebola John. What? What do you mean by Ebola, John? I don't know what you mean. Um, so yeah, I've got some jobs today. Uh, one of the annoying things is, so we hit our 500 subscribers onto um, YouTube, which was really great and fantastic. The problem is, is even though it's really annoying, even though... Um, it, it has no action. A lot of our old VODs have copyright flags on them. So I'm going to have to go through them all and remove them. Which is really annoying. So I'm literally having to go through one by one by one by one by one. This is still processing. Yeah, I'm having to go through my videos one by one by one by one by one to um, literally go in and remove any copyright flags on the content, which is really annoying. I was the last subscriber. Oh, yeah. Well, thank you, Ali, for subscribing to the YouTube. But yeah, it was quite weird, actually, because we hit 500 subs and it was like, woo, great. You know, we get all the cool stuff unlocked on YouTube. And then literally, Dino did a couple of streams and then we shot up. And now we're at 572 subscribers on YouTube. It's nuts. We just suddenly spiked. Well, it's one of those things with YouTube. You, you just manage to you hook into the algorithm and bang, you're off. And you're off to the races. And it's like everyone's watching your vids. It's like, it's great. But then if you don't hook the algorithm, good luck. It's not happening. 
Dan. Oh yeah, that one's done. I've done that one. So yeah, we're getting there. Just working my way through the content and uh, we're moving. Luckily, YouTube's got a tool where it just lets you mute the music. So it like tries to like, I'm guessing, use AI trickery to isolate the music and I think it that's been copyrighted. It doesn't even say you're being penalized for it. It just literally says, oh, there's copyrighted content. And because we've got those flags on our account, it's like, nope. But God damn it. So yeah, I was starting to like go through all the new options we've got. And it was like, yeah, uh, problem. Oh, for God's sake. Uh, so just a little bit frustrating and aggravating. I've got to slowly, hence why I'm doing Stansteads, because I thought it'd be nice and quiet. Hello, John. So yeah, unfortunately, it's it's probably not going to be a thrilling stream today. I'm not going to lie. Um, but I thought I said to you guys I'd do a stream, but I do also need to get all this stuff done, and I've got to edit some videos. So I thought I might as well stream while I'm doing it. You guys can hang out with me. Maybe play some Hell Divers. Any of you Hell Divers? Any of you playing Hell Divers? Adam and John, my regulars. So yeah, this isn't going to be ten sub worthy. I'm, I'm, you know, Ali. I'm going to tell you that one now. This ain't going to be ten sub worthy. Um, but yeah. So unfortunately, yeah, we're just chilling. Exactly. Yeah, this is going to be a very. This is a standstead and chill stream. Um, I might do a little bit of flying later on. Um, if I can get everything done, but I kind of, you know, I did say I was going to do a stream today, and I did need to catch up on my streams because I didn't do like any over the last couple of weeks. I did say I'll do some more. I also need to make some purchases today because uh, I got paid today. Whoop, 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 whoop. You know? Yeah. Oh, I oh, why didn't I hear it? I was like, oh, no, why I didn't hear it. Actually, I should... Oh, oh. keep forgetting to set that. There you go. So, yeah. I might... I, I need to make some purchases. Yeah, exactly, Adam. You've read my mind, mate. Are you the guy who plays DCS? I do play some DCS. I haven't played it for a while, though, unfortunately. Um, I am a bit naughty in that regard. I need to smack on the wrist. Because I do actually need to play some um, uh, some DCS. It's gone a bit lax in it. Um, I haven't actually played it since I've got my new monitors. Uh, for any of you new to the channel, I literally had, for the longest time, literally since I started the channel and way before that, I had just one 1080p monitor for my PC set up. And as you can see, I've now got two 27-inch 1440p's. I've got my 1080p lap dock. Cause it's not technically a laptop because it's got no internals in it. And then I've got a tablet as well that I use as my like EFB tablet here which is actually streaming from the PC, so it's acting as another monitor. So that's how I see what the, what the current weather is at Stanny, and I just keep my eye on it. I've also got cool little buttons. So I can pull up Twitch chat and everything on it. And I can pull up my charts just like that. It's very nice. Good. Um, actually, I need to uh, sort something out for DCS. I need to probably have an update in God knows how long. Let's, let's, let's load up the updater. Let's have a look. Yeah, I'll show you guys what I'm up to. Who's that? Maverick, hello. Hello, Maverick. How you doing, mate? Or in the words of Maverick. Good morning, aviators. This is your captain speaking. Absolutely. Um, so, yeah, this is all my content on our channel that I'm slowly having to make my way myself through. It's all good. Good, good fun. 15 years of DCS. So, yeah, I'm going to just see if it actually loads up. Because um, I haven't done an update for it for a while. I'm assuming it's going to load up. Yes, I am the one. If 
heard about you. Oh, have you heard about me? That's worrying. All good things, I hope. <laughs> yeah, um, go away. Um, so yeah, this is all the stuff. So I'm slowly working my way through it. Uh, copyright, copyright. That's done. That's processing. Yeah, so basically, if it has a copyright flag on it, I've got to mute the music. But the problem is, in a lot of our old VODs, we never muted the music. So when we uploaded it to YouTube, oh, it's immediately loaded up. So this is working. Okay, that's cool. I, was just, I figured there was probably a big update I've missed. So I'm having to slowly work my way through. Ah. Where's that? And literally work my way through all of these one by one by one. Oh, look, there's, Man there's Harry's last vault, I think. So yeah, and then I have to go into it and then look. It's like, oh, we found all these music. You're not allowed these. It's like, fine, mute the song, continue. Uh, mute the song only, done, done. And then it will use YouTube AI trickery to undo it all. And then mute it. And then I can close it out. But the problem is, as you can see, a lot of our old VODs have now copyright flags on them. So I've got to go through each and every one of these. That's my fun today. Uh, so yeah, that's the fun I've got today for being a channel admin. Is it music flags? Yeah, it's just music flags. But the problem is, is because it even though it flags, yeah... It's basically because on our old VODs, we didn't realize we could separate the music. So then when we uploaded the VOD to YouTube, we didn't know. We didn't know. So, yeah, I'm literally having to go through these one by one by one. Find out which, which is a lot of them. Yeah, it's all, even though I like the Fat Rat is actually royalty-free music, which is what you're listening to now. However, it still flags it. And if it's flagged, YouTube sort of scores it so even so you know i said we were trying to hit 500 subscribers and if we hit the 500 we then have all the cool stuff unlocked we've only got some of it because some of it goes well to unlock this cool feature you have to have like very little copyright flags on your account and it's like for fuck's sake half my channel's copyright flagged shit so i'm having to go for it one by one by one yeah so yeah, Fat Rat doesn't thingy. It says there's no impact on the video. However, it you ch so it doesn't it doesn't get you in trouble with the copyright holder, which in this case would be the Fat Rat speaking for the music, like the one you're listening into now. So the channel comes back and says, "Oh, there's no impact." However, the very fact it's it's flagged pisses YouTube off. So YouTube won't give you access to a lot of the their monetization features and a lot of this. Unless you remove the copyright flags. Uh, yeah, I'll be on within the hour, Kyle. Yeah, I'll probably still be in an hour. Unless it's absolutely ridiculously dead. I actually flip my window this one. Oh, actually, we got an arrival. We have. That's old Ashton. They've reinvaded again. Yeah, we got an arrival. Ryanair 2473. He's in from... Where the hell is that? Where's he coming from? Berno. Nice. See you in a bit then, Carl. Yeah, so I, I specifically wanted to stand still because I knew it'd be a bit quieter. So I can do my... Uh, where's my Twitch chat? That me tripping. Oh, I was like, why is my Twitch chat all the way up there? And then I've just realized I know why. There's a reason why. Up there. It's because I have larger picture-in-picture -picture windows. Probably actually... Like there. Someone say something. Yeah. Yeah, YouTube is very... Hang on. Let's do That'll do. You're just, you guys are just now in the middle of the screen. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do for now. 
Uh, I need to grab his rep. I need to speak to this guy because he's not called me. Oh, he probably doesn't even know I'm here. At least he's doing it right. He's doing second left on Juliet. Gonna go in 6 2 anyway. Uh, yeah, 6 2. I'll stick him on 6 2. He's Rhino. Ground, uh, good afternoon, Rhino. 2473. Just vacated uh, runway 22, uh, hoping for taxi to parking. Right now, 2473, Stansted ground. Good morning, welcome to Stansted. Taxi to stand 62 left today via Juliet and Delta. 26 left via Juliet uh, and Delta. Uh, 2473, thank you very much. Right now, 2473, uh, negative, it's stand 62 left. Why is the plugin not showing? Uh, sorry, apologies. 62 uh, left via Juliet and Delta. Uh, 2473. Oh, sorry, guys. Oh, Bezos has arrived again. Yeah. Um, yeah, basically, you have to hit 500 subs on YouTube first. And then, yeah, if you've got loads of copyright flags, apparently they hide things and restrict you from uh, having stuff. Which is a little annoying. So, yeah, I'm having to go through, find them, and then just tell them to mute the song. Which is cool, because, like I said, it, I'm guessing it uses some sort of fancy AI trickery that just like, isolates the song. So if me or Harry or Dan or whoever was doing that VOD was speaking, it would, I'm guessing, use some sort of, I'm guessing, trick to do things. That's fine. That's fine. This one's copyright flagged. So, yeah, the grind is real, guys. The grind is very real. Mute the song. Mute the song only. Boom. one dump so yeah i'm probably hammering youtube servers right now because i'm making them fix all of my videos <laughs> song continue you yeah this is the fun of being an aviators.tv channel admin <laughs> i have to do loads of stuff like this What does the number on the beginning of the runway stand for? Uh, number on the beginning of the runway is the compass direction of the runway. So if I show you, so you're probably on here. If yeah, it's the compass heading. So uh, let me just log in. You guys can see what I'm looking at. That's the wrong. So if I pull up board, Danny, airport, hide. So if I show you this, so this is Stansted. So this is the, well, it's not, well, it's semi official chart. There's not quite similar. Don't use it in real world. So as you can see, Runway 22 is on the compass heading of 222 degrees. So if you lined up on the runway, you know exactly which way you're pointing. So it's 222. 04, obviously they round it. So zip, runway 04 is heading of 042. Uh, Americans are a little weird. Americans don't use all. Uh, so here in Europe, and I'm pretty sure everywhere else in the world, bar Europe, might be wrong though. Someone chime in if I'm wrong. Americans use one number in a lot of places, so they would just say runway one. Uh, in Europe, we use two, so we say zero four. We don't just say runway four. That's, a, that's an Americanism. 
And then obviously, depending, and then if an airport has multiple runways like Heathrow, uh, up Heathrow quickly, Heathrow, uh, airport chart. So if I pull up Heathrow, if, and if both runways are pointing in the same direction, then it gives them a left or right or a center designation. And then if there's even more runways than that, where they're all pointed in the same direction, it, it will give them an ever so slightly different number. Uh, I think Frankfurt's thingy for this. If I remember rightly, I'm pretty sure Frankfurt is a perfect case for this. Uh, no, it's only got three. What airport's got four runways pointing in the same direction? Oh, I know. Um... All right. No. Uh, what am I thinking of? What airport? No. Same direction, Maverick. Not different directions. Same direction. Um. There's a European one. I'm thinking of it, and I can't think which one it is. Let me double check my aircraft. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, what air... LTAI... Is that Italia, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, let's have a look. No, it's free. So they've got left, centre, right. Amsterdam? Uh, Eham. God, I had to think about that then. God, I had to remember the code. Is... Uh... Where's the airport chart? There is. Uh, nope. Three in one direction. Nice try, though. DXB. What's DXB? Um, I, I know ICAOs. I don't know IATAs. DXB. Oh, Dubai. Um, nope. Three. No, that's two. You're lying. Oh, God. There is one. I can't think which one it is. There's an airport. You want four runways all pointing in the same direction because what they do is they give it a slightly different number. I haven't flown to Dubai, actually. That's something I've got to do. Actually, I might do it, actually, because I've, I've got a A330 in Musfas. Um, What air... Airports... If... Or runways. Look, list of airports. Uh, number of runways. Ah, oh, Chicago. Let's try that. I might be wrong, but let's try Chicago. I only wanted to show you what I meant about the uh, differences in the compass numbers. If you've got loads and loads of airports and that. 27 right, 27, 27. Yeah, see? So even though these are exactly, look, so you've got 27 right, 27 center, 27 left, but then you've also got 28. But look at the compass headings 273, 273, 273, 273, 273, 273. Istanbul. Oh, does Istanbul? Oh yeah, Istanbul's got five. I'll, I'll see if it's right because I knew that I know there's one in Europe. So yeah, that's why. So because Chicago has so many airport, uh, so many runways facing the same way, obviously they ran out of letters because they cut left, center, right, blah blah blah. So what they did was they instead of rounding down, they rounded up. So instead of calling them all two seven two seven two seven two seven two seven two seven because obviously they've only got left, center, and right, they called these this lot. 2-8, even though technically they're the exact same compass heading. Same for the other way. Look, you've got runway 9, 9, 9, 10, 10, 10. But look at the compass settings. 9-3, 9-3, 93, 93, 93, 93. No, because I'm guessing by doing it a clear, distinct number, you know, that, make, that actually makes sense. So if you know if you were given, I don't know, runway 2-8, you know you're going to be south of the main terminal. If you get given a 2-7, you know you're north of the main terminal. And same for 9 and 10. So it works. It's, but yeah, technically speaking, it's weird. 
look at look at the state of this airport. That is spaghetti junction if I've ever seen. What an absolute nightmare of an airport. That must be massive. Uh, let's check Istanbul because someone did say Istanbul because I was thinking of an. Uh, it's LTFM, isn't it? Let's just double check LTFM. Uh, LTFM. Uh, oh, you're right. Ding, ding, ding. Who said Istanbul? Olman. Thank you, Olman. You were correct. Well done. Hello, E. O'Neill. But yeah, there you go. 1 6, 1 7, and 1 8. But look at the compass settings 174, 174, 174. Yeah, this is the new Istanbul, isn't it? Yeah. Look how many ground positions they've got. Ground one, ground two, ground three, ground four, ground five, ground six, ground seven, ground seven west, seven east, ground eight, ground... They've got nine ground positions. That's insane. For the record, Heathrow, which is considered one of the busiest airports in the world, has three. That is mental. Because what they did was, if I remember rightly with Istanbul, they basically built a massive cargo airport and a massive passenger airport in the same patch of land. So literally, this is all passenger bit. And then this is all cargo up here. Southside Grand, good afternoon. Ryanair 45 Delta, radio check. Let's do some controlling, shall we? Ryanair 45 Delta, stands to ground. Good morning, Readability 5. Roger. Yeah, it would be, wouldn't it, Maverick? Yeah, basically two airports in one. But yeah, for rec for context, Heathrow has three ground controllers. Istanbul has nine. That's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Oh, London South's closing. Our rivals on the stand so we can get rid of his strip. So, yeah, there you go. So, now I hope Ali is a complete expert when it comes to runway numbers. As if there's 12 of you watching. There's 12 of you watching Stansted and Chill Stream. Hello, guys. Welcome to Aviators TV, where Spoonie's just sitting on his butt and he's got loads of admin work to do. So, he thought he'd stream and do some con uh, controlling at Stanny. Uh, right, next video. Uh, I've gone back now. I'm I'm currently in July of 2023 videos on YouTube. I'm having to go back and get rid of the copyright flags for. Oh, apparently something went wrong. Oh, hang on. I can tell I'm hitting the server a little hard because I can literally see it. So that's the ground. We're on a 45 Delta with ATS information. Whiskey on board at type A320 Neo stand 12 requesting IFR clearance to non to filed. Uh, someone's following. Oh my god, who's following? Ian Eel, thank you very much, mate. Uh, hang on. Right there, four five. Del uh, Roger, stand by. Are we back? Fine. Ryanair 45 Delta, you filed an even flight level. I need you on an odds. Can you accept flight level 270? 270, yes, I can accept that. Right now, 45 Delta, thank you. I've amended that for you, and I have your clearance ready to copy. Right now, 45 Delta, ready to copy. Right now, 45 Delta, thank you. Clear to Nantes, Nugbo 1, Romeo departure, Squawk 6474. Clear to Nantes, Father Nugbo 1, Romeo departure, Squawk 6474. Right now, 45 Delta. Ryanair right 45 Delta, read back correct. Information whiskey current. QH is 1026. Report when ready. Roger. Yeah, we, we, we do like our educational content here at Aviators TV. We like to help. We've actually helped some guys actually um, become qualified controllers on VATSIM. Obviously, not in real world because that's ridiculous. But yeah, uh, Paul and I think there was another guy. So yeah, if you join our Discord. 
Yeah, uh, loads of guys ask us questions because, as like I said, it's not just me that streams. There's six of us on this channel, and yeah, we all we all help each other out. Um, I had a funny incident yesterday when I did a flight into Belfast where I got shouted at some, by some pilots on Unicom because they said I was I was landing ro on the wrong runway and I wasn't because the winds was really bad. But yeah, like I said, we we love doing our educational stuff. Just helping guys out, and so so you learn because we get a lot of new new people who show up in the channel and they go, "Oh, I'm really new, you know. I've only just got into flight sim, yada yada yada. I don't, you know, I don't know what I'm doing." Well, like, it's okay. We'll help you out, you know. Just follow along, and you 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 know, you go fine. Like that Ryanair four six Delta. Aside from his um flight level being wrong because he's going to France. If you're flying to France, you must be an odd flight level. You must have an odd number. You're not allowed an even. There you go. There's another educational tip for you. Uh, there's several countries in Europe you have to do it to from the UK. You have to be odd. It's France, Spain, Switzerland. Uh, I think that's it. France, Spain, Switzerland. Yeah, you have to be on an odd. Hey, speaking of uh, fellow aviators, Impulse, Mr. Dan is in the chat. He's also streams on the channel. Hello, Dan. I was explaining odd even rule. After having a whole 15 minute talk about runway numbers with Ali. Yeah, speaking of odd. Ha ha ha. Puns. I didn't think of that pun. Damn it. Wasted opportunity. Good morning, aviators. This is your captain speaking. Yeah, that's for Dan. There you go. Um. Yeah, see, I haven't had to nag you today, Dan. The overlay's working fine first time. Yeah, technical stuff. While I'm going through our YouTube channel and trying to remove all the copyright flags. Oh. I'm currently in July of 2023. Get the song. I hope this actually mutes all the song. I hope it's not just, I, I hope I don't have to do this for every single individual song it's flagged. Otherwise, my God, I'm going to be here all year. That's it. Cancel all of my streams. What jet? Uh, at the moment, F-18, Ali. I am very, very rusty. Hina was giving me lessons. He's another one of the aviators on the channel. Uh... Satan's text me. Why is my son texting me when he was literally just I mean, two minutes ago? Oh, yeah, that. He's, he sent me a message by emoji. He's literally sat behind me, which is even worse. He's literally just behind me. And I've gone, what the f And I've looked, and he's sat there giggling. Um, what? Pacific Grand Run at 45 Delta, ready for push and start. Shane. Yeah, depends on which one it is. Hang on. Um, who's that? Ryanair 45 Delta, stand 1 2, push and start is approved. Push and start approved, 45 Delta. Yeah. Yeah, I love the F-18. It's a good little jet. And I get to fly off a boat. Although, don't get me wrong. I am not in any way competent with the F-18. Do you know what I mean? Just like, no, not even close. I can just about, like, get it up in the air, find, like, the baddie, see him, sh fire a missile at him, and then probably get blown up because he's probably fired one back at me. 
But I get the basic concepts of like air combat maneuvering and, you know, what you got to do and, you know, notching a missile because it can't see you unless you, it's coming straight at you, you know, that kind of thing. But yeah, I'm very, very basic on it. But no. One of our funniest um, funny clips on this channel is actually me, Fate, Hina. I think there was a viewer joining us. So there was four of us all flying together on DCS. And we parked on an apron. At, uh, I think we we're on the Caucasus cor 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 map. And literally Fate forgot to put his parking brake on and just plows his F-18 straight into mine. And I just explode and we we're all just laughing and dying. I've got no, I've got no cash. Sorry, my son wants a haircut, so I'm, I'll, I need some money to transfer over money. Um, yeah, let's gently show everyone my banking info. Whoopsie, that'd be funny. Got to try the Mirage retrial. Yeah. Make sure I'm not doxing myself. Should have hit the camera, really. Because I've literally got a button now so I can do that and hide the camera. Why didn't I just do that to begin with? I'm such a div. I literally have given myself a button on the strip that literally says, Hide cam! So I hit the button and the camera hides. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Stands to ground. Good morning, Mariner. One eight six Foxtrot. This guy's American. Oh my god, an American and he did it right. Right here, 186 Foxtrot stands their ground. Good morning. Clear to Salzburg, Clacton to Echo departure. Squawk 7025. Right here, 186 Foxtrot, including Salzburg, continue to the Clacton 2 Echo, squawking 7025. Ryanair 186 Foxtrot, reback is correct. QNH 1026, report when ready. 1026, we'll call when ready. Ryanair 186 Foxtrot. Wow, an American that did it right and didn't try and do a, a um, what do you call it? An Americanism. Sometimes you get so many Americans on the channel and they, they talk to you like you're American. And it's like, no, no, we don't do that here. Wait, Adam. What's that? What? Oof, that sound quality. What happened? What? What? What happened? What? Oh, you mean on him? Yeah. He's obviously got a very, what's the word? Open mic, so it's picking up all up. Probably hear the hum of his aircraft in the background. Um. They... Hey, it'll... yeah, it didn't sound half as bad as my own on my headset. That's why I was a bit confused. I was like, oh, it sounded quite clear on my headset. But then I've got it set up. I've got the equalizer set up to emphasize on voice on like on the EQ. Hey, it already takes a lot of time to learn to plan. You have to work. You're probably busy. So look. I'm likely going to get time. It's just bought a tap. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Right now, four five Delta ready for taxi. What? What's with the trolling? What, what's going on here? Why is everyone picking on me? Maverick, I see you. Ryanair 45 Delta, taxi holding point Romeo 1, runway 22 via Alpha, Hotel and Romeo. Taxi to holding point Romeo 1 via Alpha, Hotel and Romeo, 45 Delta. Romeo. So yeah, actually Dan, I've got a question for you. Because you are an S3. About to soon, hopefully, become a C1. He's going to hate me for this question because he's probably going to go, I ain't got a bloody clue. Um, why does the SRD um, specifically want Goodwood in the um, flight plan? Uh, not this guy. I was about to say, you can't even see the window. I was going to pop the window up. You can't even see it. Um, yeah. Why does um, 
Why does SRD specifically say so when you're going to from Vapid? Did I? No, I didn't. Did I? I've. I can't remember. I can't even remember having a conversation with Dino about his personal YouTube video. So I don't even know what you're talking about, mate. Oh. Did I really ask you yesterday? You're tr I'm, I'm losing my mind. Ooh, we got another aircraft. Nice. Hopefully, I'll fly with you someday, air refuel, and help you if you have any questions, just like you're having me now. Alex, that'd be cool, mate. Like I said, I just yeah, I really want to do that on DCS and just like get a big bunch of us together and just muck about. Just go on like a like a silly like PvE server or something, and just like shoot down some AI and something, and just muck about, and learn that way. Because I was really liking Hina's like showing, but Hina was going really like in depth, and I was like, oh, I just blow stuff up, and and then like learn as I go. Not that I don't appreciate it, because like I said, he was like he was literally making training missions up and everything. It was really cool. Ryanair four five Delta, no further ATC available. Free call Unicom one two two decimal eight. Have a safe flight. Bye bye. Unicom, have a good day as well. Ryanair one eight six Foxtrot, ready to push and start. Ryanair one eight six Foxtrot, stand four two right, push and start is approved. Push and start approved. Ryanair 186 Foxtrot. Oh, that Ryanair. Oh. Oh, okay. Hello, James. Welcome to the channel, by the way. Ah, oh, that's cool. Dino can fix it. Okay, that's fine. Why is there six, oh, there's 16 of you watching me? <laughs> 16 of you, just me doing a chill stream on Stansted Ground while I remove YouTube copyright flags. This is, well, I assume November 8th on is explicitly wants Goodwood as its VOR on the airway, so it's probably being pedantic. Yeah, because you, obviously up in November 859 is on, also goes from Vapid down to Goodwood. 18 now, Jesus. Literally, that's why I'm, literally, I'm just having a nice chilled stream. Like I said, I said to my regulars, I was going to do a stream again today. Yada, yada, yada. Officer, I've got loads of bits to do. Like I said, I've got to go, go through my YouTube copyright flags on all my old VODs and get rid of them. Because apparently YouTube, even though it has no impact on your channel, YouTube doesn't like them. So when you become a YouTube partner, they're like, I was like okay, fine. Fine, I'll move them for God's sake. Jesus. So I've literally uh uh I'm about hundred and twenty something through. We've got hundred and seventy one videos on our YouTube channel and I'm about hundred and twenty something through. So yeah, this is the enthralling content you guys are tuned in to watch. Spoonie removes YouTube flags. <laughs> no, I'm not even joking either, look. So you got like, oh, I'm not even joking. Look, here's my here's what I'm looking at right now on my main screen. Here's all of our content. YouTube.com, by the way, forward slash at aviators underscore TV. You can see the link up here. Look. There's a there's a channel name. 
Come and watch some of our content. That said. Yeah, I figured there's some reason, but yeah, for some reason, I'm guessing it's a sim briefism because the SRD is probably right, but sim brief tells them from Vapid, it always does the flight plan from Vapid, you upper eight, upper November 859 all the way down right, into France. Ah, uh, oh, uh, who's that? Ryanair 186 Foxtrot, taxi holding point Sierra 1, runway 22 via Charlie, hotel and Sierra. Holding point Sierra 1 via Charlie Hotel and CRS. Ryanair 186 Foxtrot. Uh, yeah, it's the guy who just left. It's, um, hang on. Um, who just, we pull his flight plan. Well, it's, it's amended anyway, because I've, I've changed it. I think it's up in November 859 all the way down to Sopil, which is in France. Uh, it's the guy that just left. Uh, where is he? 45 Delta. Ryanair 45 Delta. He's going to Nantes. Oh, no, it wasn't. It was a guy going to Barcelona. I tell a lie. Uh, where's the guy going to Barcelona? It was on a Nugbo. Uh, uh, I can't find him now. Is he disconnected? I was on a Nugbo. There was a guy going to Barcelona. I know that much. And he was his flight plan was... Um, he keeps flagging it as um, wrong. Yeah, there it is. Ryanair 54 Lima Zulu. Hello, Ped. How you doing, mate? Like where to where? Yeah, Stansted to Barcelona. He's Ryanair 54 Lima Zulu. How's it going? I don't watch flag content. Wow, Maverick. Why am I getting a notification? Ugh. Oh, well, my view account's going to dive. Oh, no, that was yesterday. Oh, maybe not then. <clears throat> Ryanair 186 Foxtrot. No further ATC available. Free call Unicorn 122 decimal 8. Have a safe flight. Bye-bye. Over to Unicom. Thanks for the service. Have a great day. Bye-bye. You too. Take care. Yeah. I figured it was just the SRD, but I'm, I'm presuming there was a reason for it in the SRD. But yeah, it was just, like I said, Simbrief then screws them because what Simbrief does is it will say from Vapid, you just take up in November 859 all the way down to Sophill. And then obviously SRD flags it and goes, there's something wrong with that. You have to be quick with flight. What do you mean, Ali? What do you mean when you say, do you have to be quick? which is correct, so SRD should be ignored. Okay. It, well, it makes no difference. Anyway, I, I never give them a reroute, by the way, Dan, just to, just to clarify. I never reroute them. I just amend it in the flight plan, so flight plan checker says it's okay. Because obviously I know November 859 and upper November 859 go exactly the same way. So, after good, well, except that, well, it technically doesn't, but it makes, no, it makes such little difference. I just amend it. I don't give them a reroute. I mean, rooting the flight path, or is it automatically rerouted? Um, yeah, I know. I just tripped over my own words. I know November 859 is different. Um, 
I'm saying that portion up to Goodwood, November 859, and upper November 859 go the same way to Goodwood. It's the same airway, essentially. It's just altitude. So, easy ops instead to Belfast. Cool. Oh, I see you. I'm going to make you blue. I put Kyle. There you go. You, you are now the blue strip. Oh, I just realized my, um, my V strips is purple. That's Luton colors. Orange. Stands dead. Thank you. There you go. Ryanair's gone. He's on his way. A little bit waddly on takeoff. Information X ray now current. Weather's calmed down a bit since uh, the other day. I see the nutty weather. Oh, uh, windy. Look at it. Although there's another one coming. Look at this. God damn. That is a... What, what, what the fuck is that? Look at this monster. Transatlantic's going to be very interesting flying. Because really, if you're going transatlantic, you're going to want to go really up high north and come over this way for the tailwind. Look at the state of that. That is a nasty looking storm. It's weird because it's not like it's not directly round either. It's oval because look, the wind comes round and round and it's like got a little eye here and a little eye here. How weird is that? Yeah, I bet you transatlantics. I bet you if we look on plane finder. No. If you look transatlantic, I bet you they're all going really up high north. Pretty much. They're all going up by, uh, up, up and over. Some of them are going straight over. Some of them are being Patrick a little brown, brave. Uh, good morning, sir. This is Walker 1349. I can't leave. Yeah, they're going this way. For left, uh, Boeing 737-800 with information whiskey on board. Of a QNH of 1026 requesting alpha clearance to Dortmund. Love the way you can hear his GSX in the background. Uh, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Walker one three four nine er stands to ground. Good morning. Clear to Dortmund. Clacton two echo departure. Squawk five six six two. Clear to Dortmund via the Clacton two echo departure. The squawk in the box will be five six six two. Walker one three four nine er. Walker one three four nine er. Reback is correct. Information X ray now current. Q and H one zero two six. Report when ready. X-ray with the QNH 1026 and we're up at wind ready. Thank you. One, two, four, nine. Cool. So, yeah. Wind's a little bit mental. So, if you're going transatlantic today, you definitely go, want to probably go up and over. Or take advantage of the of the, um, of the the clear spot here. Because that's what it looks like a lot of aircraft are doing. They're going this way, through this, this green blob here. And then catching this. And then, wing, they're going to get launched down the uh, east coast of the U uh, U.S. What's the rain like at the minute? Yeah, that's a bit of a... Uh, rain's not too bad, but yeah, that's a nasty looking storm. Look at this. There's an eye here. And there's almost like an eye here. And my son's photobombing the camera. That's a great tailwind. Yeah. Do you know what? Confession time. I've never actually done across the pond. <gasps> That's the storm the USA just said. Oh, is it? Sunset ground, good morning to you, Easy 985 Hotel, uh, 895 Hotel, stand 41, Airbus A320 with X-ray, departure clearance to Belfast. 
Is the 895 Hotel, Stansted Ground. Good morning, Kyle. Cleared to Belfast, Aldergrove. Utava 1, Romeo departure. Squawk 5655. Clear to Belfast for the Utava 1, Romeo departure. Squawk in 5655. Five. Easy 895 Hotel. Easy 895 Hotel. Read back correct. QNH 1026, report ready. Bah, 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 bah. We'll call ready. Thanks very much. Easy 895 Hotel. Dan, Dan, Dan sending me DMs. What, what's going on now? What's he, what's he looking at? Yeah. Well done, Carl. Round of applause, everyone, for Carl. Oh, I was going to do it. Where was it? Bomb. Uh, Gem Lotelia. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome aboard to Rover TV. Hope you're doing well. Hello, Focus. It's going all right, mate. Uh, today is Stansted and Chill because Spoonie has got uh, 171 old YouTube VODs to go through and remove all the copyright flags from them because YouTube's getting pissy at me for it. Yeah, it's not doing too bad. I, this is one thing I always like. If you're a newbie to VATS and controlling, I highly recommend Stansted. It's such a good little airport to learn at. I'm going to do my S2 training here, hopefully. I love Stanny. Stanny's my favourite airport. Yep. I can't wait to get my S2. Cannot wait. All right, Ali. Thank you very much, mate. See you later. Hope you have a good day, mate. Take care. It's 21 people <laughs> watching me control. Where were you all yesterday when I was bombing around, like flying around in stormy UK weather? Huh? Or is it, oh, Spoonie's flying. No one cares. It's probably, actually, to be fair, you're probably used to me being on X-Plane. So they're like, oh, if Spoonie's flying, he's on X-Plane, it's going to crash and there's going to be horrible... Let's not bother. But no, hello to the 21 of you watching. Hope you're all doing well. Uh, right. Next one. Mute. Continue. Mute song only. Continue. Mute. Oh, were you out yesterday, Way Focus? How dare you. EX plane, please punish yourself. Yeah, I know. I know, I know, I know. Control, yeah. So, for those of you that weren't on the thing yesterday, I am going to clip those videos up. Um, I'm probably gonna because I did what did I do? I did Brussels into Manchester and then Manchester into Belfast yesterday because I was t doing some stormy weather flying. Is there a Phoenix on X plane? There isn't a Phoenix on X plane, Carl, but there is a Tolis. Tolis do Airbus aircraft and they are very good. It's just X plane itself at the minute is a bit shockingly bad. Um. Yeah, so I did. I was coming into Manchester, and I got was getting ridiculed on Unicom because. That's it, Ground Walker One Three Four Nine. Gate Six Four Left is requesting push and start. Walker One Three Four Nine. Stand Six Four Left. Push and start approved. Push back approved for One Three Four Nine. Hello, Jem. Welcome to the channel. Hope you're doing well. Um, what was I going to show you? Oh, yeah, I was going to show you Belfast, weren't I? 
uh, or Adam can, Adam will be nodding his head in agreement to this. So basically, uh, where's the airport? Here's Belfast, right? The Belfast has two runways. The terminal building's here. It's a very small little airport, right? Now, every what so the, the the winds were really bad at Belfast when I came in. I think the winds were blowing up basically this in this. Oh, was it this direction? Yeah, I think they were coming across this way, right? So they were coming from the north straight down, right? It was like it was something stupid. Um, if I remember right, it was like a twenty odd something knot crosswind. However. Anyone that controls at Belfast. That's the ground. Good morning. Is that 578 Yankee 321 on the western apron with X-ray clearance to Exeter? That's fine. That's fine. Uh, Zap 578 Yankee stands to ground. Good morning. Can you just confirm your aircraft type for me, please? Yep, we're at 321, Zap 578 Yankee. Zap 578 Yankee, thank you. Clear to Exeter. Nugbo 1 Romeo departure. Squawk 2160. Good X, send back by one Romeo, two one six zero. Zap 578 Yankee. Zap 578 Yankee, reback is correct. Uh, QNH 1026, uh, engine startup is approved. Report when ready for taxi. 1026, and we'll call taxi. Zap 578 Yankee. And Zap 578 Yankee, I'm going to assume being an A321 or, a, yeah, A321, you're going to need full length, aren't you? A7. Roger, thank you. Right, so I'm going to highlight him to say he's going to need to cross the runway. Because that's what I'm supposed to do. So, yeah. So. And stand stay ground, put your highlighters down. It's easy 895 hotel, ready for push and start. Easy 895 hotel. I'm trying to explain something, you're not helping. Um, stand for one, push the start is approved. Uh, push the start approved, easy, 895 hotel. God damn it, Kyle! Right, uh, um, so yeah, so everyone that was at Belfast at the time was landing on 3-5 because the it would have given them a straight headwind. However, in real life, and because of the fact 3-5 is a very small runway, jetliners were landing on 2-5 and just taking the crosswind. So I did the same thing because you jets never land on one seven or three five. Even the VMATs that we controllers use, which is like our rule book for Belfast, say you only use one seven and three five if they cannot land on two five zero seven because of crosswind. You never land on this one. One of the reasons being is a lot of aircraft use one seven and three five these days as a taxiway rather than a runway. So I came in on 2-5, had to go around, and everyone started shouting at me at Unicom. No, 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 active runway is 3-5. I'm like, no, it's not. No, it's not. It really ain't. Because, look, if you see this whole section of the airport down here, look, the only way to get anywhere is you have to, have to taxi on the runway. You can't, you know, because all this is all shut down now, look, and it's all closed off. So, yeah, so I came back round, did a go around, came back round, landed on 2-5 again. And again, as I came into 2-5, some guy went, 3-5 is active. I went, yeah, bear, on, bear in mind on the wind it is. But A, I'm a jetliner. And B, 3-5 um, is only used in exceptional, like at pilot's request. And C, I'm on Unicom. So, pfft. and the guy just went, oh, huh, well, that'll be a challenge. I was like, yeah, shut up, go away. But yeah, ooh, weather's another big wave of bad weather coming into the UK again. If in doubt, yeah. And actually, Adam, who's in the chat now, um, he um, he looked at real world flying, and he saw every plane coming into Belfast was landing. Uh, every jetliner was coming in on two five. So it was like, thank you very much. Oh, that's the city airport. Wrong one. Whoops. Where's the Belfast order? Right here it is. Although I said it, watch this plane. What is that? A? Why is that plane done that? I'm not tripping or anything, am I? 
that plane that's coming on 2-5 landed and then vacated left. What? What the fuck is that? What's this jet 2 pilot? And he's backtracked. Uh, I can't see his squawk because I don't pay. Um, yeah. Yeah, James. Very Brian, correct. Walker, what's for on requesting uh, taxi? Switch back. Walker, 1349, uh, taxi holding point Sierra 1, runway 22 via Delta, Hotel and Sierra. Taxi to holding point Sierra 1 for runway 22 via Delta Echo and Sierra. Walker, 1 2 4 now. No. No, because it's showing him at the moment. I, uh, I don't know. I'm really confused. This flight plan's all over the shop. I don't get it. Hang on, let me show you guys the. Does it show me he's come from... Where's he took off from? Presswick. So he's taken off from Presswick, landed here. Yeah, because he's coming, because he's come from dark green to light green, and then white means he's on the ground. So he's come down. And then, yeah, he's vacated to the right. And it's tracked him coming all the way down here, and now he's backtracked. Sunset, uh, ground, Delta 6389, 787 800. IFR to Manchester with information, x -ray. Fine, that's fine, that's fine. Delta 1659R, Stansted Ground, good morning. Clear to Manchester, Utava 1 Romeo departure, Squawk 2021. Clear to Manchester via uh, Utava Romeo departure, Squawk 4021, Delta 1659. Delta 1659, negative, squawk 2021. Roger, 2021, Delta 1659 air. Delta 1659 air, read back correct. QNH 1026, report when ready. Easy 895 Hotel, we are ready for taxi. Easy 895 Hotel, taxi Charlie, hold short of hotel. Charlie, hold short, sure. hotel, easy, 859, Charlie. Hotel, I mean. I love the fact I literally, did you hear me on, on the stream? I could hear me in the background. I could hear him from the stream delay. Oh. That was funny. What is that 578 Yankee? We've run the numbers, uh, we're able uniform, ready taxi. Zap 578 Yankee, all oh, very brave. Taxi holding point uniform, runway 22 via Whiskey and Golf. Whiskey and Golf to hold uniform, Zap 578 Yankee. Right. Easy 895 Hotel, give way to the Boeing 737, taxiing from your right to left on hotel and then continue taxi left on hotel and romeo that hold romeo one for runway 22. all right give away to the walker 737 and then taxi hotel and then right turn on to romeo and hold romeo one easy 895 hotel walker 1349r no further atc available free call unicorn 122 decimal eight have a safe flight bye bye Want to do some light for Walker once for Nana. Cheers, buddy. Have a good afternoon. You too. Take care. Um, he's gone. So, yeah, this Zap A321 is going to go from uniform. And he's an A321. That's interesting. The little screen on the right showing down is right. Uh, yeah, it's my departure board. You like my departure board, Jim? I'm still slightly new to VATSIM, but I love these controlling streams people do. Oh, cool. Well, you're more than welcome. Very, very welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Easy, 895 Hotel. No further ATC available. Free call, Unicorn, 122 decimal 8. Have a safe flight. Bye-bye. 
Over to you, Sean. One, two, two, that's all. Thank you very much for your service, and I'm loving your stream. You're very welcome, Carl. Have a good one, mate. Bye-bye. Thank you. And his script is gone. Right. I'll have to let the zap know. Yeah, I'm glad you like our departure board. And where everyone's going. Yeah, it must be. Is he still there? Have we inadvertently found some drama going on in the real world? I'm looking at him now. Yeah, he's still there. Unless the ADS has gone completely batshit, but I don't think it has. There's just a Logan Air flying right over the top. Meow. No, I can't, I can't see a squawk, so someone else will have to tell you if he's squawking 7,000, because I can't see a squawk code. Yeah, 1410. Zap 578 Yankee, no further ATC available. Free call Unicorn 122 decimal 8. Just be advised there's an EasyJet 8320 uh, lining up on a threshold. Have a safe flight. Bye bye. Unicorn Zap 578 Yankee, but I'm in sight. Bye bye. See, professional, giving him uh, traffic advisory. Going to do it from uniform. A321 from uniform. He's going to absolutely have to, what, toga it? Is he stuck? That's halfway down the runway. He's going to be getting to like, mm, butt clench moment before he gets hits V1. I wanna, oh, wish I'd tell you up now for this. Oh, well. Uh, what did James say? Sorry, what like with Washington Dallas? If the wind is very strong, there were some things used free zero for landings. We usually use it for departures. So what planes would have to do is do the one right. Yep, yep, yeah. Same for Belfast, but yeah, I just got shouted at by uh, loads of pilots on Unicom for you doing it the correct way. All right there goes eight nine five. There goes Kyle. Don't screw this up, Kyle. We're all watching. Oh, Kyle. Oh, bit windy, Kyle, is it? A bit windy, Kyle. <laughs> Let's follow Kyle, shall we? Hello, Kyle. You're a thousand feet and off the, you've gone off the threshold a little bit, but it's okay. Oh, oh dear. Oh, dear, dear, dear. It's 578 Yankee lining up. A bit windy, mate. <laughs> I hate it too. When you get caught and you just see the wings go, wee! It's like, oh, shit. No, 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 no. Back, back, back. Everyone in my house is coughing. I'm finding this very disturbing. I've got one son over there just going, uh, 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 and then I can hear a son outside in the hallway coughing. I'm like, oh, God. I'm like, uh, oh, I want no leggies. I don't want the cough. No, I do not, Ashton. I'm not having no cough. Thank you. Right. Zap's next. Yankee now current. This is a little bit windy. It's not. It's not. It's not as bad as it was yesterday. It's two one zero at fourteen at the minute. I just want to see this A three twenty one because he, he's got to have to toga it, Eddie. Uh, goes. Yeah, he's 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 punched it a little because he's suddenly shot off. Airborne. 
Ooh. Ooh. Go on, give me an up arrow. Hey, he's up. Oh! <laughs> I think he got airborne about here. Literally here. God damn, he weren't mucking about. Well done. Round of applause for the zap. Got the clap, yeah. Yeah, let's give pilots gonorrhea. Why not? All right, so last one left on the ground at the minute is this Delta. He's going to Manchester. He's obviously wanting to do some stormy weather. Right. Yeah. Right. So, right. Let's go back to what I was really doing on YouTube. Hello, Lunga. Is that you, is it? Welcome to the channel. You are my only customer at the moment. So all my attention is on you. There you are. Dun, 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 Right. Uh, what video was I up to on YouTube? This one. See details. I have to refresh the page. I've noticed when I keep doing this after a while, the videos start lag. The, the page starts lagging. I think I'm breaking YouTube, guys. Oh, ad break. Fuck's sake. Ah! I thought Bezos was supposed to warn me when ads come in and like give me a notification saying, oh, ad break starts, but I haven't been getting them recently. I just get, it just pops up and goes, there's an ad break. I'm like, right. Uh. Struggling. That is the north side cargo and hangars. Uh, yeah, pretty much. Well, a bit of both. So, this bit here is cargo. You can see my map. So this 500, uh, 504, because there's the Harrods hangar. So that is ca cargo here. Over here is like um, in flight and oh, uh, what's the company? What's the company that flies? Tight? Is it Titan? Titan Airways. They're private aviation, like jet, like corp corporation jet. Hangars are here. And then up here, you've got some more just like GA. Aircraft parking and various bits and bobs and hangers and whatnot. And then down here, you have the diamond hangar, which is where the Antonov used to park when it came to Stansted. And then you've got the Ryanair hangar here. And I'm pretty sure they're called, respectively, Hangar 9, Hangar 10. Hangar 1's up here. Probably would have been better if I showed you on Google Maps, to be fair. Uh myself now. Uh, it's Danny, Danny, Bishop Stortford. There it is. No satellite view. Uh, so yeah. Rotate it a bit. Oh, too much. If I do it that way, there you go. Now it's in line with the runway. So yeah, there's a diamond hangar where the Antonov used to park. Nice, that's got a lot of aircraft there at the minute. There's the Ryanair one. And then on the other side, yeah, here's Harrods. Harrods Aviation's here. You see a lot of private jets parked up here. There's Harrods. And then, yeah, you've got the in-flight in -flight jet center. And then Titan Airways is based somewhere over here as well. Uh, where's Titan? Titan Airways, yeah, it's down here. 
Sunset uh, Ground, Delta 1659, you're ready for push. I saw the notification. Why, why are you seeing the notification? I didn't see the notification. Uh, Delta 1659, uh, stand 34 left, push and start approved. Push and start approved, Delta 1659. Hello, Epic Fall, welcome to the channel. Arids is Hangar 5 and Text Pipe, yeah. I figure they did as well, but they do cargo as well, don't they? With my longitude when I fly. Yeah. Pretty much, if you're GA, definitely just start up here. If you're a GA aircraft, definitely start up here. Really, I, I get a lot of GAs that start down here, and it's like, mm, I'll let that go, though. But yeah, do not start up GA anywhere over here or here. Because that's this is the FedEx apron here. This is Zulu. So there's a little FedEx building here. If I switch back to the maps, you'll see what I mean. So yeah, and you've got the FedEx. FedEx, come here. Here's the FedEx building. So this is their special apron that you've got just for them. And then all the car the cargo apron is here, the main one. So UPS, Royal Mail, Swiss Port, they all park up here. And then all this over here is the passenger apron. So, yeah. I uh, don't know what's going on in that Google image. Uh, excuse me. Hello. <laughs> Whoopsie. Mistakes were made. What happened there? <laughs> that, as a ground controller, is what I call a screw-up. <laughs> yeah, they got rid of it, didn't they? Because it used... It was... Which one did they get rid of again? Is it, got, is it this one they got rid of? Wait, go back. I'm going back. What? What? It might be two images stitched together. If it is, it's a very good one because I can't see the join. I can see there there's a join, but I don't know whether that's because it's new, like, pavement. Because technically, as a, gra cause that, technically, as a ground controller... If you've got this going on and making one guy go like that and then like that and then like that and like, yeah. He should have been coming down here already. Thank you. Oh, just made my nose. My, something's just tickled my nose. Um, yeah. So I was just saying. So if they were both actively taxiing, that's that I'd call that a whoopsie. I know, not necessarily. I'm just talking about me being efficient. Is one of them you're going to have to make stop. One guy you're going to have to then make go round the other one and then let the other one go. Not efficient. I'll be turning left onto right, right onto the apron. Could be actually because there's a lot of Airbuses there. Although there's one pushback. So if he's put if he's got a taxi, he's got to come onto one of these. So he's got to be careful. Yeah, the north side one. Yeah. Yeah, the north side one. Yeah, this one right here. I wonder what they're doing up here then. I wonder. Who's that following? Learning to fly. Way! Well, that's a very apt username. Welcome. Let's actually swatch back. Crown Delta 1659, ready for taxi. Did you see that professional timing there? Absolutely professional. We've got aircraft coming in as well. We've got Lufthansa coming in. Delta 1659, uh, taxi holding point Romeo 1, runway 22 via Bravo, Hotel and Romeo. Holding point Romeo 1 for only 2 2. Bravo Hotel Romeo, Delta 16599. Oh. Who's coming in? There he is. Who needs an enemies? Where's he come from? Oh my god, that's a name and a half. He's come from Braunschweig. Braunschweig. Woo, perfect timing. Ignore spit. What? Oh, okay. Thank you, Epic. Ignore Spoonie. Jet 2 is still at Belfast. Oh dear. Something's gone very wrong there at Belfast, I think. 
Maybe it's just parking up, having some lunch. Speaking of which, I need to do that at some point. Because I've had no brekkie, no nothing. I'm starving, we're getting here. Uh, uh, Lufthansa's going around. Yep, Lufthansa's gone around. Uh, what? Oh, am I having a stroke? Because I've just read Surly say Brown sh V I G. And then Maverick put Gone Tech maybe. Am I having a stroke? Because words are not making sense to me anymore. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. That may Brown V I G. Brown V I G. What? Brown V I G. Ow, my head hurts. I can't. Brown, brown. Brown Zvigy. Brown Zvigy. Brown Zvigy. Brown Zvigy. Wow, that's a, that's a mouthful. I'm on about the plane at... Oh, may have gone tech. Oh, okay. Guys, Paul from put uh, Big need to post here. How do you become an ATC in London? Question mark. Do you mean in real life or learning? Wait, learning to fly twelve. You're definitely learning. Um, what? The sh is sh the what is that the so brown Schweige. brown Schweige. Is That where I'm going with that? That's him. Oh, that's him. Uh, you have to apply. That's him. Dot uk. Uh, like everything. Uh, but if you apply to be va uh, a UK controller, you cannot apply to be a controller anywhere else. You're restricted to UK unless they give you visiting permissions at other places. Delta 1659 and no further ATC available. Free call Unicorn 122 decimal 8. Have a safe flight. Bye-bye. I'll go with the Delta 1659. Uh, good to watch your stream. Thank you. Take care. Oh, I I saw it. He said a minute ago. He said I'm one six five nine. Who's that? Uh, I've forgotten the name now. Yeah. Lunga, thank you, Lunga. Oh, not G at the end. What is it at the end? G. So Braunschweiger. 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 That right now. Can you not stop distracting me. I'm supposed to be doing administrative tasks. You're welcome, Lunga. Yeah, come on, stop distracting me, you lot. Bounce what? Bounce. Oh. No. Not Gert as in. <laughs> Kill me now. Uh, end the word like you would iceberg. So, Braunschweig, 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 Braunschweig. Braunschweig. Mason Jason Aviation. Hello. Welcome to the channel. Hope you're doing well. I don't know why I said hello. Welcome to the channel because you're not even a first time child. But anyway. Hello, Mason. Welcome. Braunschweiger. Braunschweig. Braunschweig. I keep saying gur. Braunschweig. Yes. That'll do. This has become a thing all over itself. Were you doing admin tasks today, Spoonie? No, I was too busy learning how to pronounce Braunschweig. And getting berated by the chat for not doing it correctly. <laughs> Infinite power.
That's fucking... That's... I think I might have to do multiple thingies here. Oh, no. Mute the song. Go. Oh, I've actually... I'm not even joking. I've got, like, a legitimate headache. Although, actually, that's probably because I'm not wearing my glasses because I'm an idiot. Learn words with Spoonie. Yeah, should I change the stream title? I'm surprised Surly hasn't done it, actually. Just to troll me. Don't even think about it, Surly. I'm looking. I'm watching. Right. Infinite power. Oh, these are so annoying looking at my old, my old stream because it's, oh, God. This is going to be a slog and a half. Briefly, Emirates, good day. Any flight recommendations out of Stanny in an A319, 320 Neo, 321 or 321? 21 people, yeah, I know, 21 people watching me learn how to speak, apparently. Although it's German, so is it really speaking? Stanford Ground, good afternoon, Ryanair 186 November at stand 53 left. Information the Yankee, Boeing 737 800, request FR clearance to Salzburg. Ryanair 186 November, Stanford Ground, good morning. Cleared to Salzburg, Clacton 2 Echo departure, Squawk 0563. Ryanair 186 November, Cleed, Salzburg, Clacton, to Echo Park, Chiscork, 0563. Ryanair 186 November, readback is correct. Information Yankee current, QNH 1026, report when ready. Information Yankee and QNH 1026, then we'll report when ready, Ryanair 186. I should have just told Why can't I hear that? That should be right, that should be right. Uh... Why can't I hear that? Oh, because it doesn't want to change, apparently. No. no. I want it to be that. Ah! That. Oh, I, I probably know why. Hang on. Oh, that's right. Why can't I hear? Uh, uh hello ground golf delta echo Victor x ray is definitely uh, one fifty two. Sally, did you really just send me a voice message with how to pronounce it? Uh, Golf, Delta, Echo, Victor, X-Ray, stands to ground. Good morning. Uh, can you just file a flight plan for me with just the routing as VFR circuits? Uh, Wilco, Golf, Delta, X-Ray, Victor, X-Ray. Oh, my God. We've got VFR circuits. Ah! Better get my lip out just in case. What are we on 2-2? Two, two? It's going to be left-hand, isn't it? Left-hand circuits. But I'm actually needing to pull charts out, guys. Look at me. Look at me being a professional. Doesn't need... A... Yeah, I know, but it just helps because he comes up as a strip. Because then I've got him and I've got a taxi him with other aircraft. No, he doesn't need one. I'm just asking him to do one. I, how do I create one? I can't create one for him, can I? How do I create one? I've never created one for him. You can create strips. What? Yeah, I know I can create a strip. 
Let me see. Thank you, Andrew Santa, 8771, vacated, parking 14. Isn't that... Oh, what a surprise. It's our favourite person. Lufthansa 8731, stands to ground. Good morning. Taxi to stand 1-1 one, one via Juliet and Alpha. 1-1 via Juliet and Alpha, Lufthansa 8731. Yeah, I know I can create strips, but I can't... You've confused me now, Dan. Ryanair 25 Romeo, radio check. Ryanair 25 Romeo, stands to ground. Good morning, readability 5. Oh, what a surprise. You can yeah, but I, yeah, but if I didn't know what his call sign was, how can I create a strip? Where's this guy coming from then? Oh, whatever. You're such a troll. Oh, no, he's not. Take it back. Ryanair right, 186 November at stand 53 left, ready for push and start. Ryanair right, 186 November, stand 53 left, push and start approved. Push and start approved at uh, stand 53 left, Ryanair right, 186 November. Strip without a flight plan. Yeah. Yeah, I, I didn't think about that. Yeah, he's done me a flight plan anyway. Beautiful, beautiful man. Cessna 152, yada, yada, yada. Golf, Victor, X-ray, stands to the ground. Uh, yeah, I've got your flight plan. Um, I'm just going for it now, and I'll call you back with clearance in a moment. Oh. Uh, thank you, Golf, Delta, X-ray, Victor, X-ray. Oh. oh, sorry, he's not right-hand circuits, he's left. Left-hand circuits, he's on 2-2. Two -two. Golf, Delta, Echo, Victor, X-Ray, have your clearance ready to copy. Uh, ready to copy, Golf, Delta, Echo, Victor, X-Ray. Golf, Delta, Echo, Victor, X-Ray, hold position after departure from runway 22, cleared left-hand circuits, not above altitude 1,500 feet, VFR, on Stansted Q&H 1026, Squawk 7010. Cleared to hold one way two two left hand circuit, altitude not above one thousand five hundred feet, QH one zero two six, squawk seven one zero. Golf Delta Echo Victor X ray. Golf Victor X ray just confirmed squawk seven zero one zero. Squawk seven zero one zero. Golf Delta Echo Victor X ray. Golf Victor X ray, reback is correct. Engine start up is approved. Report when ready for taxi. Uh, we'll call you Golf Echo Victor X-Ray. Oh, um, um, Lloyd. So yeah, for the regulars, for the regulars in chat, uh, the Lufthansa that's just coming from Braunschweig, uh, is uh, it's Michael, it's Captain Michael. He's done Braunschweig to Stansted in a 789. But yeah, that's fine. Good. I know you don't have to make them file a flight plan. Can I make them? Can I make them a flight flight plan, like so it shows up in Euroscope? I mark that. Okay, it's not. No. Oh, okay. 
I just find it's easier, it's particularly for controllers, because then obviously the aircraft pops up on their on their list. So, like, it's just for the Euroscope, I think it's pretty helpful if this strip comes up and shows them. Don't you think, Dan? Is this a debatable topic? Or mean you're going to have a row? All right, now on it's 6 November, ready for taxi. Right there, 186 November, taxi holding point Sierra 1, runway 22 via Charlie, Hotel and Sierra. Taxi holding point Sierra 1, runway 22 via Charlie, Hotel and Sierra, right there, 186 November. I just generally create strips if using these strips. Okay. What, we, what, what, it's just memory. If you were doing, so if you were Essex right now, you'd just remember. Wow. Ballsy. Ballsy, ballsy, ballsy. So if you say like, if you loaded up in Essex right now and he hadn't filed a flight plan, you, obviously I know you'd give him Squawk 7010, but how would you get him to show up as on your radar? Or would he, would he show up correctly? I don't Down know. to 187, 31, uh, stand 11, 7, 8, 8 9, IFR to branch vehicle with Yankee. Lufthansa 8731 stands to ground, cleared to Braunschweig, Clacton 2 Echo departure, Squawk 0536. Clear to Braunschweig, Clacton 2 Echo departure, Squawk is 0536, uh, Lufthansa 8731. This guy's a real life pilot, by the way, apparently. Lufthansa 8731, read back correct, QNH 1026, report when ready. One zero two six. Uh, we're ready. Uh, Golf Delta Echo Victor X Ray, ready for taxi. Golf Victor X Ray, Roger. Taxi holding point Quebec One, runway two two, via Juliet, November Hotel, and Quebec. Uh, cleared to taxi to holding point Quebec One, runway two two. Via Juliet, November, Hotel, and Quebec. Right air, 186 November, no further ATC available. Free call Unicorn 122, decimal 8. Have a safe flight, bye bye. Uh, 6 Unicorn 122, decimal 8, right now, 186 November, thanks, bye. Didn't even realise we were over. Oh, sounds like it's the only one, ready for a push. Oh, look, it's the most rapid fire setter up I've ever seen. Lufthansa 8731, stand 1 2, push and start approved. Uh, He's only been parked on the stand for like 30 seconds. What have they done? Throw them all, throw the passengers all out the windows. Could he even get the FMC set up in 30 seconds? I don't even think he could. Will you get mad if we start on the runway for gliders? Yes. Yes, we will. Do not spawn in on VATSIM on the runway under any circumstance whatsoever. Do you even do gliders on VATSIM? I don't even know. He's a real life pilot, so of course he's that quick. Yeah, sorry. How? how sorry. My, my mistake. Oh, look, of course he is. Like, what? what is, like, what? <sighs> okay. Lufthansa 8731, taxi, holding point, Romeo 1, runway 22, via Alpha, Hotel, and Romeo. 
Ska jag med mig andra? Ja, så har jag med mig och sen så är det sen från. First thing that comes up on the Vatsim, new people test and people, st- yeah, yeah, do not, do not. This home airport is Miami, yeah. He is American because you can hear from his accent. But apparently, he's a real world American Airlines pilot, apparently. Apparently. Since why he's banned. And I'm the king of Uzbekistan. Well, app break. Yes, yeah, see, see, Surly, I didn't get warned. Surly, I didn't get warned. There was an app break. I didn't get warned. I watched it that time. I was li- literally looking at the chat. It did not warn me. Still not updated his scenery either. Because he's still mowing the fucking grass. Lufthansa 8731. No further ATC available. Free call Unicorn 122 decimal 8. Goodbye. How much what I bet he's going to do a go around? He'll come back around again. He probably won't now because he's probably watching. He's heard that. (laughs) Surly's on the warpath. Or land at Luton, yeah. Yeah, good shout, Focus. Very good shout. Yeah, probably do something like that. Stop getting distracted now. I need to go back to YouTube. Oh. Yeah, I bet YouTube servers are probably hating me right now because I'm literally just going in and just going, mute the song, mute the song, go, next video, mute the song, mute the song, go, next, mute the song, mute the song. problem is is like i said with my old vods we didn't uh separate the audio from the twitch stream so all of the fat rat songs i was playing on my streams are coming up being flagged I've got to mute each and every one of these songs off of the YouTube vids. This is going to take forever. 
But hey-ho. At least I've got U20 lot to keep me company. Oh, uh, yeah. Golf Victor X-Ray at Quebec 1. No further ATC available. Over to Unicorn 122 Decimal 8. Have a safe flight. Bye-bye. Over to Unicorn at Quebec 1. Uh, Golf X-Ray Victor X-Ray. Thank you for your service. You're welcome. Have some good circuits. Wilco. Boom. Give it a strip. Um, um. I heard that if you have YouTube Premium and download videos to watch offline and then play even a few seconds, it counts as a full view. Really? Really? Because I have YouTube Premium. I have a house with loads of children, so YouTube Premium. Actually, all the music you're listening to right now is actually YouTube Music. It's not Spotify, it's YouTube Music. Because I pay for it all, so there's a little cost-saving tip for you. If you spend a crap ton on subscriptions, I highly recommend getting... Um, YouTube Premium, because not only then do you get unlimited YouTube with no ads, but you also get access to YouTube Music, so you get basically a music service and YouTube bundled in as one. Although, be careful if you buy it on YouTube Premium on iPhone, because iPhone charge a premium, so it's like 18 quid on iPhone. Whereas if you do it directly through YouTube, they only charge you like 12 So there you go. There's a good cost-saving tip for you. And YouTube Music, to be this day, unless you're like looking up really vague music, has got everything. And YouTube Music's pretty good as well, because even if, if there isn't a direct song version, it will just play the video version. So if someone's done a YouTube vid of a song, it will just play the video. Maybe you should, Surly. Maybe you should. Because if, like I said, if you listen to music and you're paying for Spotify, why are you paying for Spotify when you've got YouTube music? The only, the only downside is, is there's no PC app for um, YouTube music. You have to go through via browser, which is a little annoying. So right now, the music you're, you're hearing, the music you're hearing is actually playing off of my phone, which is then connected to my computer. and then being piped to you guys. Because then I've got the YouTube app, so then I can control the YouTube app. I can hit buttons and then change the track if I need to. There you go. Top tip for you guys. So yeah, if you're paying for YouTube Premium and you've got Spotify, <clears throat> you, you may be ever so slightly wasting money. Well, I finally made it into June. It's looking better. So essentially, that one got. That's looking a little better. Going back through some of the ones I've already done that still got flags on them. So I'm like, okay, there was a second flag. Okay, go in. Run, Rudolph, run was apparently flagged. Who was that? Dino. Is that Dino's video? Yeah, Dino's video. He played run, Rudolph, run, and it got flagged.
Oh my god. Do you know what got flagged as well, Dan? You played all... I, I think you did this. Did you do all by myself? And it got flagged. Yeah. So, it's got a bit quiet. Yeah. Right. Got one aircraft. He's got, going up to Keflavik. Uh... Oh, yeah. Um, Surly, are you still in the chat? Sorry, I got distracted then. Something popped up on my thing. I was like, oh, yeah, good point. But is that even right? Yeah, no, it is. Um, Surly, you there? Surly? Uh, can you DM me, Surly, your uh, Gmail YouTube account password so I can mod you on the uh, YouTube channel? <laughs> yeah, I need your... Well, it says channel URL of a user. I'm guessing that's like your... You, yeah, I need your YouTube ID or whatever. Oh, I'm going to sneeze again. Oh my god. That let you hook you up like that way. Let me have a look. Uh yeah, I know that that's you, isn't it? If I do that and save. You should get a ping. Hey you Sally, you've been modded. You are, not only are you modded, Surly, you are the managing moderator now. Well, hey, congratulations, Surly, you have been knighted. Yeah, you have a sword and spanner. I never got that. Was that YouTube just trying to deliberately be like, well, we're not having swords? Dunstan Ground, good afternoon. Flare 1 Alpha, mission Zulu at AC21. Neo, request clearance up to Keflavik. 
player one, Alpha stands to ground. Good afternoon. Clear to Keflavik. Utava one, Romeo departure. Squawk six three three seven. Clear to Keflavik. Utava one, Romeo departure. Squawk six three three seven. Player one, Alpha. Player one, Alpha. Read back is correct. QNH one zero two six. Report when ready. And his route's wrong. I've just cleared him and his route's wrong. What's wrong with this? You said by try to train up in November uh, to Pole Hill, up in November 61 to Tala, to Rat. Oh, it's because he's. What? Again? Oh, that's another SRD thingy. But that's free route airspace. Fuck up. I'm not even touching that one. It's saying his routing's wrong because he's going, um, he's going through the free route airspace. And the SRD says, well, really, all he needs to do is... Oh, this is going to be Edinburgh. This is an Edinburgh issue. Uh, Buzzard. Why has he not got Tango 420 to Trent? That's weird. 420 to Trent. Then uh, up in November 5... Why has, he got... Why has this guy literally got no waypoints in his routing? November 5-7 to Pole Hill. And... November 601 to Impip. Ah, oh, that's right. That was a weird room. So yeah, he's going to need a reroute because... Oh, I'm going to mark and flag him as a reroute. We've got two aircraft flying up each other's bums on the way in. That's helpful. Uh, what? Oh, what a surprise! Guess what, guys? Our favourite uh, American Airlines pilot literally right after... Oh, it's not even... Hang on. Yeah, he's disconnected. <laughs> yeah, he disconnected. He didn't even stay around long. So he basically took off and then disconnected. No, he's not. He's disconnected. He's gone. So he took off for no reason. Because he's gone. Because I have him. I can. I can track him. So I was tracking him to see what he was doing, and he's he's gone. Yeah, he's off the network entirely. Our little Cessna's coming back round. I'm guessing for a touch and go. Yeah, I really do need a haircut. All right, uh, I need to have a look at the channel. No. That's annoying. Well, he's gone. He's off the network. Gone. So yeah, he took off to go back to Braunschweig and he's just immediately disconnected. He's gone. Uh-oh. Uh-oh.
So yeah, I just pulled up that prism just to see if he was actually heading back to Braunschweig, and no, he's gone. He's logged off the network. Brussels is looking quite busy again. I enjoyed flying out of Brussels, actually. That was quite good. A little airport, Brussels. Ground, good afternoon. Easy 356 and Airbus A320 nil with uh, information Zulu. At stand 64 right, requesting the IFR clearance has failed. Easy 356 stands to ground. Good afternoon. Uh, just confirm your call sign. I've shown you logged into the system as Easy 355, but you just call me saying Easy 356. Sorry, my mistake. Easy 355. Easy 355, not a problem. Um, I've just gone over your flight plan. There is a little minor issue with it where it's got no jetways added in. I'm I'm pretty sure it's just an oversight. I'm just going to send you the quick reroute. Can you just confirm that's all okay and then I'll give you clearance? Okay, no problem at all. Easy 355. Yeah, he had he had he had Utava Quebec seven five buzzard, and then it was direct, 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 direct through UK airspace. Which player one alpha stand four four request push and start. Player one alpha stand four four push and start approved. Push and start approved. Stand four four player one alpha. Yes, focus. I have invested in a few. I have got a few. Hello, ground. Easy 355, uh, far plan confirmed. Easy 355, Roger. Thank you very much. Uh, you are cleared to Edinburgh. Utava 1, Romeo departure. Squawk 0225. Utava 1, Romeo departure. Squawk 0205. Easy 355. Easy 355, negative. Squawk 0225. 0225, easy 355. Easy 355, reback is correct. QNH 1026, report when ready. Uh, ground, uh, Golf Echo Victor X ray, hello again. Uh, request uh, taxi to Hangar 8, please. Hangar 8, uh. That's a diamond. Gold Victor X ray, stands to ground. Hello again. Taxi hangar 8 via second right onto Juliet. Have a good day. Bye bye. Stand to ground, this is AC805. Looking for IFR clearance to Gatwick. I'm at, I'm at uh, stand fi uh, 53 left on A320 now. Um, yep. Uh, uh, information to do it, by the way. Um, yep. Yeah. Okay, two stations there. Um, Easy 805 stands to ground. Hello. Stand by. I'll call you back with your clearance in one second. Uh, London is on, so I'm going to have to coordinate with them because you're going to Gatwick. Uh, Golf Victor X ray, just confirm you got my taxi instructions. Uh, clear to taxi, uh, second uh, right on Juliet to Hangar 8. Uh, Golf Victor X ray. Oh, London's going to love this one. Uh, 805. No, no pre note. Um, Stands to the ground. Good afternoon. This is Easy 263, vacated 22, although I don't have my chart open, so I don't know what taxi I'm on. <laughs> Easy 263, stands to ground. Good afternoon. You need your charts, mate. Taxi second left onto Juliet, please, and then. Bravo, stand three two left. Taxi second left onto Juliet and then uh, Bravo. And can you repeat the uh, stand, please? Stand three two left. Stand three two left. Cheers. I'll get my chart open so I don't uh, get lost. Uh, that, that I know that just tickled me. I don't know why, but it did. Uh. Right, 
Pinged London. Hello, ground. We're requesting pushback and start. Easy 355. Easy 355. Stand 64 right. Push and start is approved. Push and start approved. Easy 355. Oh, yeah, that, I don't know, that just tickled me. It shouldn't have tickled me that much. I just love the fact that it just went, yeah. Oh. He's, he's taking it. Uh... Wait, what? Where's Easy Eight Zero Five gone? Wait, what? Why is he dis? Is he just disconnected? Why? What? Stand to ground, run out. Right, Adam Zulu Whiskey Stand Nine with ATS information. Zulu Type A Three Twenty Neo requesting IFR clearance to Limoges as filed. Just said, wasn't it? Uh... Easy, 6-3, whiskey, stands to ground, good afternoon. Clear to Limoges, Nugbo 1, Romeo, departure, Squawk 0 7 four, two. Oh, I've just realised I've cleared him, he's... Cleared to Limoges via the Nugbo 1, Romeo, departure, Squawk 0 7 four, two. And apologies, did I say uh, easy jet? I meant Ryanair. Uh, Ryanair 63 Whiskey, I'm not sure, did I say it? I, d I don't know. Either way, Ryanair 63 Whiskey, reback is correct. Uh, Q and H is 1026. Um, however, I have just noticed on your flight plan you filed an even flight level. Can you accept flight level 250 to Limoges? 250, yes, I can. Lovely. I've amended that for you. So, yeah, your final flight level will be 250. Stands to ground easy 263. We're just holding by the fire station because we've got our chart open now. Uh, would you be able to just I'm sorry about this. Easy 263, not a problem. Uh, it's taxi, you're on Juliet. Taxi straight ahead on Juliet and it'll be your second right onto Bravo and stand 32 left. Gotcha. Uh, Bravo, 32 left, easy 263, chief. This, I'll spread Emirates, show me. Hey! Player! Player! Very nice. Yeah, I'm ignoring player one alpha's uh, route error on the flight plan checker because I know it's because he's flying through free route airspace, which is free route airspace, but apparently flight plan checker thinks it knows better. I'm ignoring that one. Run a six three whiskey requesting push and start. Ryanair 63 Whiskey, stand 9, push and start approved. Yes, that time you did say easy. Let the player play in some free, free whatever airspace, exactly. Player 1 Alpha, request taxi and disable, uh, request full length. Player 1 Alpha, Roger, taxi holding point Sierra 1, runway 22 via Charlie, Hotel and Sierra. Holding point Sierra 1 for 22, two, Charlie, Hotel and Sierra, player 1 Alpha. I was about to say, you're going to get given full length anyway, because look, look, look where you are. Request taxi, easy 355. 
Easy 355, Taxi, Delta and Hotel hold short of Charlie. Delta, Hotel, hold short of uh, Charlie, Easy 355. Just in case, because technically... Perfect ground, EZ263. Did we manage to correctly locate 32 left? EZ263, spot on. Thank you very much. Hope you have a good day. Bye-bye. I'm buying a lottery ticket. Amazing. Woo! Woohoo! will be a millionaire, guys. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, I know why the player one alpha specifically said can request full length, even though he's going to get full length anyway because from where he is in the airport. But yeah, he's going to Keflavik, so probably as an A321 Neo, he's fully loaded. Air break. That's the ground, easy 263. We're going to be refiling a new flight plan and uh, departing shortly. Are you going to be online for a while longer? Uh, easy 263, A firm. Excellent. Excellent. Player 1 Alpha, no further ATC available. Free call Unicorn 122, Decimal 8. Have a safe flight, bye-bye. 128, Player 1 Alpha, where to set? You too. Easy 355, continue taxi, hotel and Romeo. Hold Romeo 1 for runway 22. Continue hotel, hold uh, Romeo 1 for runway 22, easy 355. Come on, way away with me. Way with me. Right. Here goes player. Here goes Emirates. He's out of here. Way with me. Runner 63 Whiskey requesting taxi, runway to two. Runner 63 Whiskey, uh, can you accept holding point Quebec 1 for departure? Give me one second, let me just find that on the chart. Yes, Quebec 1 should be okay for 63 Whiskey. Ryanair right 63 Whiskey, Roger. Taxi holding point Quebec 1, runway 22 via Alpha Hotel and Quebec. Alpha Hotel and Quebec to Quebec 1, 63 Whiskey. Where the moon and water meets. Waiting for easy to come because that arse needs to burn a bit more fuel. What? <laughs> Okay. Well, play. He's on Unicom, so you'll have to tell him. Tell him to go. He's probably waiting for you. And then another screenshot. Very nice. That misfits. That explain. That explain. Yeah, it's definitely not misfits. It might be misfits. No, it's, it might be, yeah, it's Musfus because the clouds. That's, that's X plane. I don't know. I'm really confused. Oh, it's X plane. It's X plane. Wow. Just stuck with my gut. Clouds are looking a little better in the, that update. I will give X plane 12 another go when uh, 12.1 comes out. 
Ryanair 6 free whiskey, no further ATC available. Be advised your number three in the queue. And there's also traffic just establishing on uh, the localizer now. Uh, over to Unicom 122 decimal 8. Have a safe flight. Bye bye. Unicom and number three after the traffic landing. Thank you very much. See you later, potentially. Easy 355. Still on my frequency. I do apologise. Over to Unicom 122 decimal 8. Have a safe flight. Bye bye. So I said. Over to Unicom, easy 355. Whoops. Whoops. No, I didn't. Whoopsie. Mistakes were made. All stations, all stations. Stand to the ground. We'll be back in one minute. Oh, I need to go for a week. Back in a sec, guys. And I'm back. Uh, Easy. Five, five, five. Jesus. Oh, please, you're not forced to go around here. Oh, he's Utava, so he should be clacked. But, mm, ooh. This is why I want to be a tower controller. Good Lord Almighty. Right, he's airborne, so he should be all right to go. He needs to turn. He's going to need to turn left because he's on a Clacton. I remember rightly. I might be wrong. I can't remember. Where's he going? Edinburgh. No, he's not. He's Jutava as well. <gasps> That's fine for... Sp what? Between... Yeah, okay, for the landing. Okay, maybe. But Jesus, these two... Nope, it's good. Oh, okay. Yeah, that okay, was probably okay. Okay, not fine for Yeah, I was about to say, that's not fine for spacing. Oh, he's just disconnected. <laughs> but yeah, that wasn't fine for spacing. And yeah, it was kind of slightly close. God, if this Rhino then pulled out my... Standard ground, easy 263 at stand 32 left. Uh, aircraft type Airbus A320 Neo with information Alpha on board requesting IFR clearance to Amsterdam. Easy 263, stands to ground. Hello again. Clear to Amsterdam Schiphol on the Clacton 2 Echo departure, Squawk 2715. Clear down to Wild IFR to Amsterdam on the Clacton 2 Echo departure, Squawking 2715. Easy 263. It's 263. Reback is correct. Information Alpha now current. QNH 1026. Report when ready. Fine. Right. 
He's about on Twitch at the minute. He's, he's doing stuff on Twitch. Let's have a look. Let's have a look, just in case we... Uh... That can't be right. Why is my... What? what? Oh, because it's recommended. I was about to say, why is my channel number one on Twitch? And then it was like, oh, that's why. Because it's, um, it's done it by thingy. Um, God damn it. Because obviously I followed the channel, so it's like, oh, yeah, there we go. Viewers. There. We oh, we're number four. No, one, two, three, four. I um, can't count. We're number five. I will take that. So we're behind. Jamie's in number one. Uh, someone called Oz Flight Simmers, number two. Captain the Beebs, number Simba three. Five to turn in on the hotel. Uh, who's this? Blue Max 9252 Stansted Ground. Good afternoon. Welcome to Stansted. Uh, taxi, second left if able. On to Juliet. Uh, sorry, I've just seen you actually just turned on to hotel. That's fine. Continue taxi on hotel. Then Papa, Juliet, and Charlie. Stand 5 free right. Think about that then. Uh, so, sorry about that. Hotel, Papa, Charlie, uh, Stan. 5 2 right, did you say for Blue Max 9252? Blue Max 9252, it will be Hotel, Papa, Juliet, Charlie, 5 3 right. Hotel, Papa, Juliet, Charlie, 5 3 right for Blue Max 9252. That'll do. There goes Ryanair 6 3 Whiskey. He's out of hit. I just got traffic, traffic. Oh my god, this guy's doing everything to hit me. Oh god, where, where is he? Let's have a look. I'm looking at him a bit. Oh yeah, he is literally up your bum, isn't he? Uh, he's at 12,000 feet. You're at 11,000 feet. Because you're fully loaded, so he's climbing above you as well. Ouch. Yeah. That's why you give SEP. That's why you leave separation right there, ladies and gentlemen. Uh. Is he literally following you? He is, isn't he? Yeah, he's literally, yeah, but he's above you now. Yeah, he's 2,000 feet above you. If I were you, player, um, sorry, if I were you, Emirates, just slow down your rate of, uh, rate of climb. Let him just shoot above you. They'd give me two minutes and depart. Yeah. Yeah. Don't worry about it, player. Just literally, I would say, because you're heavier, just slow down your rate of climb because I see you climbing about 3,000 feet. Go down to like two because he's climbing at... Uh, why is he leveled off? Oh, God, I don't know what... Okay, now, yeah, he's climbing at nearly three. So, yeah, just slow your rate of climb. He'll just shoot over the top of you. By the look of it, have you got more ground speed than him? No, he's got more ground speed. Yeah, I would lessen your rate of climbing. Hello, Rhino 9, 7, Fox, Fox, Kilo, Rhino 8, 21, stand 5, 2, I, 5, 2, Trieste, F, 5, please, and Alpha, Kilo, 8, 1, 2, 6. What? What is with these Ryanairs loading as A321s? That, that's just not allowed. What is this? Ryanair 97 Foxtrot Kilo stands to ground. Good afternoon. Clear to Trieste on the Clacton 2 Echo departure. Squawk 6357. Clear to Trieste, Squawk 6357 on the Clacton 2, 2 Echo. Ryanair 97 Foxtrot Kilo. Ryanair 97 Foxtrot Kilo. Read back correct. Information Alpha current. QNH 1026. Report when ready. Okay, thank you very much. Ryanair 97 Foxtrot Kilo. Ryanair A321. Uh, no, 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 no. So yeah, we're, we're number one, two, three, four. Yeah, we're number five on Twitch at the minute. Whoop, 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 whoop. Whooping everybody's butt. Which ain't bad for an ATC stream. Let's be. Oh, no, I'm not. Oh, I've got bumped down. Boo! Boo! We got bumped down. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm now number seven. 
Stands to ground, EZ263, stand 32 left, ready for push and start. I was doing so well. <laughs> Easy two six three stand uh three two left push and start is approved. Push and start approved, easy two six three. Boo boo Easy three five one and one two one decimal five. Why is the TX button great? He's with a la on guard. What? Who's easy three five one? What? On one two one decimal five. What? Oh, do you mean easy three five five? You mean the guy that's up? You like flying behind you? One two one decimal five is the emergency. No, it's 351 on X-Pilot. What? Who's easy 351? Where's this guy? Where is he? Hang on, I'm zooming in now. He's at Gatwick. Easy 351 is at Gatwick. Yeah, easy 351 is he's at Gat he's parked at Gatwick. <laughs> oh dear. Right, uh, Blue Max is on stand. We can get rid of his strip. Ugh, Jesus. Oh, gotta love that, Sim. I uh, actually have no clue where he is. Chinese guy, of course. Oh, dear. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, I've had history with, yeah, people like that that have come on and on oh, that, Sim, and they've got no idea what they're doing. Where's F player? Let's have a look how he's doing. He's, he's done, actually, he's done as I've said. Good man. He's on the emergency frequency. Oh, I wouldn't bother. Let him get on with it. Let him figure it out. <laughs> so he's at 26,000 feet. He's at 21,000 feet. London Central comes on. London Central's going to have a fit. <laughs> uh, there'll be a... Player one alpha, left turn immediate, please. Heading to you know <laughs> two seven zero. Avoid traffic. Yeah, one two one decimal five isn't even the isn't even the frequency for Gatwick. He should be on one two one eight zero five. Yeah, yeah, he's over the top. Well, he's nearly over the top here. First the ground, easy 263, ready for taxi. Easy 263, taxi holding point Romeo 1, runway 22 via Bravo, Hotel and Romeo. Taxi holding point Romeo 1, runway 22 via Bravo, Hotel and Romeo, easy 263. Yeah. Yeah. Just manage it as best you can. Anything you can do. Slow in the Mac or Lord, yeah. So yeah, we were doing so well on Twitch, and then we just tumbled. Oh my god, we're tumbling even worse. No, we're not. Have we gone down? Yeah, we've gone down a little. Yeah, I do find that funny, though, how we've... Hey, Emirates, thank you for the follow, mate. Welcome on board. Appreciate it.
<coughs> Pardon me. Oh. Right, what time is it? I passed one. Uh... Oh, easy 263, no further ATC available, free call Unicorn 122, decimal 8, have a safe flight, bye-bye. And a tremendous shame that is. Thank you very much for your excellent service today, easy 263. You're very welcome, take care, have a good one. Aww. Cheers. Aww. Aww. I'm blushing. Aww. Uh, right. I think what I'm gonna do is, yeah, I'm gonna get do nine seven fox shot kilo, get him out, and then I think I'm going to call it there for today. Cause what's that been? Three hours. I think that's been long enough. I think I've done a good stream. Been just a nice little chill one. I'm gonna. I'll probably still about. Don't don't get me wrong, guys. I'll still be about because I've got stuff to buy some add-ons to buy from us for and whatnot so i'll probably be about on the discord so i will be getting all that sorted so i'll wrap up the stream get that sorted do a few bits and bobs around the house because i've got a shop uh shop delivery coming and then yeah that'll be me done get things ready get my wife sorted because she'll be coming home in a couple of hours. That is my plan. What are you guys up to for the rest of the day? Got anything exciting going on? Oh no. Yay. Sally's in with Eclipse. I've missed you in your clips, Early. I've had nowhere near as much YouTube short content <laughs> since you've been gone. In fact, Surly, I'm ordering you. You need to go through the, all the videos you've missed over the last few days and find clips and clip them. <laughs> I haven't done any of my video editing today either. That's all you guys' fault. Oh, Harry Potter tour. Nice. I've been there. That's cool. I like that. That was cool. Although, God. Yeah, take plenty of cash with your focus for the souvenir shop at the end or the beginning. Because, my God, the merch shop costs a fortune. John, five more episodes of Brookside. Jesus. What? Brooks? Wow, that's a blast from the past. That's not back, is it? Or are you lying to me? Or is this some joke? No, it got cancelled years ago. Brookside. Wow, that's a blast from the past. A lad's first time though. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I've been there once. Yeah, the merch. Fucking how, how expensive is the merch? Like 80 quid for a hoodie. Jesus. I think I bought a pin badge. That was it. And that cost me like 20 quid. Although I did buy, it was a very, actually, no, it was about 10 or something. But I bought a really nice pin badge of the Hogwarts Express. That was cool. It was like proper solid metal one and everything. It was really nice.
Yeah, probably. Probably. You're probably not wrong. Disgustingly enough, yeah. Ugh. Oh. Big one. Right. This 97 Fox Rock Kilo is not exactly moving, is he? Oh, come on. Yeah, Brookside. That was, that was a good reference. I, and no one outside of the UK got that one. Oh, and our view counts dropped dramatically. Is that because I said I was wrapping up by any chance? If they, everyone's gone, no, he's wrapping up. I'm bored now. I'm going. STV reruns release five episodes every Wednesday. Really? Nice. That's a very old brass from the past. I think my mum used to watch Brookside back in the day. Fork me that text to speech sound just scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Oops, is it, is it a bit loud? It's kind of like, a, I've got like, it's like a, it's an issue I've got with the Twitch alerts because I need it loud enough so I can actually hear it in my headphones, but it's obviously then a bit too loud for you guys. Sorry. My bad. Uh da 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 da. This this guy's not gonna go, is he? So I wrap the stream up. So I wrap it up now because this guy's taken forever and he hasn't moved in ages. Uh, who's on? Shall we raid? Shall we do a raid? We haven't done a raid for a while. Who should we raid? Who shall we raid? Who shall we raid? I, part of me wants to say Nabeeb. Actually, Nabeeb's doing something pretty cool, actually, because he's doing storm chasing. Shall we, shall we go raid Nabeeb? Yeah, we're going to go raid Nabeeb. Right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to... Let's wrap up the stream. EasyJet Simpilot. Who's that? EasyJet Simpilot. Who's EasyJet? I can't see him. I can't see him. No, we're going to do Captain Nabeeb. There's a reason why, because Nabeeb often raids us, so we're going to raid him back. And he's also doing something cool, because he's doing storm chasing, which tickles my fancy quite a lot. So we're going to do some storm chasing. We'll follow him around to do some storm chasing. So, uh, all stations, all stations, stand to the ground is now closing. All stations, over to Unicorn, 122, decimal 8. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye. Three, two, one. Disconnect. Disconnect. Close that. Exit out of that. Done. 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 Right. Actually, I better check because it's late for him, Nabib time. Is he fit wrapping up his stream? Hang on. I need to listen. Yeah, he's staying on. Cool. Right, we're going to rain the beeb.
Yeah, yeah, we're gonna go raiding the beep. So thank you to everyone for joining. Um as always, youtube.com forward slash at aviators underscore TV. If you haven't already, please come over and give us a subscribe. All of our VODs and everything go up on there as well as Dino with his plane spotting vids and our funny compilations and clips all go on that channel. So please consider giving us a subscribe. We also, when we get our multi-streaming set up, we're going to be streaming on YouTube as well. So what we do is we're going to do team up streams. So like Dan, who's in the chat, Impulse, he will um, do one stream to one place and uh, at one position, I'll stream at another thing. And then like you can see both views at the same time and things like that. So please consider giving us a subscribe on YouTube. That'll be great. Yeah, big shout out to everyone uh, for following. We've got quite a few followers. Thank you to Emirates. Thank you to Hoverboard. Thank you to Learning to Fly. Thank you to Kyle. Thank you to Jem. Thank you to E. O'Neill. Thank you to Langers. Thank you to Kyle Rocks. Thank you. And that's it. That's all the follows. Thank you very much. As always, your support is greatly appreciated. Right. As you know, usual thing with the outro. I'm going to do the outro, play a song, and then we'll do the, um, we'll do the raid. Or I might just do it straight after the outro. Yeah, I'm going to do it straight after the outro. So I'll just run the outro and then we'll do the raid. All right, guys. I'll catch you on the next one. Have a good one. See you later. Oh, no stream from me tomorrow as well, by the way, because it's Thursday. It's my usual day off. But I'm, I'll probably be about on the Discord. I'll see you, everyone. Bye. Um,